Hey guys, if you don't already know me, I'm Fahim Saleh, the CEO of Gokata. Uh, I know I've been a little bit quiet uh, as of recent events um, with the motorcycle transport ban in Lagos, but I've been trying to process it and, and figure out how I exactly want to uh, speak on the topic. New information on a brutal murder on the Lower East Side. Police have identified the man who was killed and dismembered. His body was found by his sister in a luxury condominium. CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis is live on East Houston Street with the latest on the search for the killer. Jenna? Well, Dana, you can see police have the building here on East Houston Street taped off and guarded. We're told investigators have surveillance video of a person of interest entering the apartment with his face covered, but they're continuing to search the area for more video, which could hopefully get to the bottom of who did this. Assalamu alaikum, brothers and sisters. I hope you are well. Fahim Saleh, Patau and Gokada entrepreneur found dead in New York. Saleh was discovered by his sister after she said she would not seen him for a day and went to the apartment. The entrepreneur was best known for his role in creating popular startups in Nigeria and Bangladesh. Gokada, one of the firms Saleh co-founded, tweeted to confirm his death. We are deeply saddened to inform you about the sudden and tragic loss of our founder and CEO, Fahim Saleh, the firm said on Wednesday. The Daily News reported that he bought the apartment last year for $2.25 million. The Daily News said CCTV footage taken Monday appeared to show Saleh entering the elevator followed by a man in a suit with a hat and gloves and a mask over his face. On leaving the elevator, Saleh fell to the ground. His body was reportedly discovered, decapitated and dismembered with an electric saw placed nearby. Astaghfirullah. The law enforcement source said some body parts were missing and investigators think the butcher may have been scared off by her sister trying to get into the apartment before he could finish the disposing of the remains. In addition to the elevator, a stairway led from the apartment to the building exit. Brothers and sisters, this is very sad and shocking news. People are actually committing the crime like the same way in the movies, like Hitman for example. Astaghfirullah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect all of us. Ameen. The most important thing we can do is to make dua for our brother. It is our continual prayer, dua and remembrance for the brother that will benefit him. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive his sins and grant him Jannatul Firdos. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant sabr to his entire family and friends. Ameen. Until next time, Assalamu Alaikum.